Hi everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. For all of you that don't know, Holly does a media hair and makeup course. Anyway, she's got to the final stages where she needs to do her assessments. And for that, she needs to use me to do them on. And mum happily agreed to have Casper. So therefore, I did become Holly's model for the day. This is what we got up to. So the plan is I go to Holly's workstation in the media hair and beauty department and um, join her there and that's where she's going to be doing my hair and I've just been to the canteen and got a coffee because I need that to keep me going but yeah this is the college she's in there now it's actually quite cool the facilities they've got and to be fair it's nice that mum's in the cafe now just looking after fun so I can I don't know, let Holly pamper me and, and all that. Here we go. She's in here somewhere. So tell me what we're doing today. What's the plan? I'm doing a 1960s of chrome, which is like the famous beehive hair like when they've got the bump and it's like a half up half down sort of style with it so and um bump. hopefully it goes well have you ever done it before no i'm winging it not even Literally. on a not even I'm on not a even, model i've not even practiced don't tell my teacher that and i'm the guinea pig <laughs> i don't know how i feel about that i'm the guinea pig but I, it, well, even, you suited the last I one. I should suit the last one. That was all right. What did you do last time? Like a 1940s 1940s, on me. Like victory rolls. Yeah, and that was quite nice. Mum has got Casper for the morning. I'm having my hair done, even if it is going to be a little bit wild. I've got a coffee. Hey, it could be worse. And I'm with my lovely daughter. It could be worse. Yeah. But it should be an interesting morning. Shall we... Um, go in. Let's go in. Let's see what it's all about. It's good that the college actually serve oat milk. Wow. Is this uh, your workstation then? Yeah. So you got your clips, got your straighteners. What straighteners are we using? Oh, unbranded head head fix. I bet they're as good as any other. Well, they might take some beat. So what are we doing now, Holly? Yeah. So I'm assuming my hair is going to be... Yeah. We're using Silhouette Hairspray. Schwarzkopf. I don't know if I've pronounced that right. It's looking good. Is it going how you want so far? So it's starting to take shape, so it's starting to look quite good. There was a reason I didn't wash my hair last night because it would have been an absolute pointless thing to do. Waste of time, waste of shampoo, waste of conditioner because the amount of product that's gone on the hair already and we're only halfway through. It looks very wedding y, doesn't it? You know what I mean? Like you would expect like a veil now to come down the back. So what products have we used, Tolly? Talk me through. Um, this. This is pretty decent, this it's product, It's just like some it? sort of powder to like... Give it like a bit of lift, give it a bit of body. I guess so. It matches my nail polish. This stuff is meant to be really good. It does what it says on the bottle. It says height riser. That's what it's called. And Holly didn't know what it was. <laughs> so you put a bit of powder on the roots and it gives it a bit of body. So actually I might get myself some of this. That's what I need. 
So it's basically like a powdery hairspray, basically in a powder form. And now she's getting rid of the flyaways. I'm trying. Trying. Smoothing it out. It's a bit messy at the back, I'm not gonna lie, but I don't know. We will get there, right? Do you enjoy what you do? Sometimes. Quite a creative person, aren't you? I feel like this course is for creative people though. Yeah. Sort of. So it's a media hair and makeup course. So basically that means they do lots of different creations, you know, like for film, theatre, I don't know, modelling, any kind of thing like that. So Polly's in her last year and she's nearly completed it. And these are her final projects and I get to be involved lucky me so i'm really loving the look i feel like i'm getting married all over again so we need to go and put go and put some um i don't think everyone realizes i'm vlogging and <laughs> um, we need to go and put some lipstick on and get some eyeliner and then we're almost complete Wow, I really like it, Hal. Do you want me to do um, a I really like it? Yeah. Can we do it in that room? Yeah, I love it. So this is where they do makeup. So I'm not having like a full face or anything like that. She's just gonna do like a little bit of eyeliner um, just to sort of complete this look. I think you've already done some really nice natural makeup this morning anyway. Well, you know, you're welcome, Holly. I did it especially for you. I haven't really got, I've just got like a little bit of blusher, uh, very minimal mascara. How do you stop the look, like you know when you put a powder on and yeah. you, it, you end up looking more wrinkly because you put powder on, how do you stop that from happening? Yeah. Do you know what, it is an eye base, a good eye base, an eye primer you really need to so, yeah. um, just keep it nice and smooth. So I've invested in a quality one then. Yeah, definitely. The pair fit ones are quite nice actually, the ones we've got here. Yeah, Holly was saying. Yeah, these ones are really good. How did we see this brand advertised, Holly, when we went out? And you what, went, oh, that's. Was it the airport? Yeah. Oh, yeah. They? Mm -hmm. they had like a little section on it, and I said to Mum, that's what we've got for our kids in college. The thing is, um, I remember Shannon and Megan were saying, oh, yeah, the perfect's really good, but I've never heard of it before until it came into college, to be fair. It's all over TikTok and like Instagram and what have you, because they just. They've got so many ambassadors and stuff now that come in, especially the Crown Foundation. But I swear, like, Ecky's still a blood eye. She's got her own, yeah, she's got her own um, range with her. Yeah. She does all the, like, um, the glow, like, highlighters and stuff like that. So. Oh, okay. Yeah, she's really good. Yeah, she's got her own range with her. 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 That's what we're going to use. We'll use this. Yeah, we'll use these. Do you mind being using them? No, it's fine. Maybe like sweating and like thinking, ooh, <laughs> I don't want you to use them. I wanted to frame them forever. <laughs> I feel proper pampered today. <laughs> I'm picking up some good tips here. <laughs> I don't know who's been educated, me or Holly. <laughs> and, and the more confident you get, you see, you don't, don't want to go too crazy today and like do anything like a massive just to do those little like I'll see you when she gets the scissors. Do people realise they're drawn or can you get away with it? Yeah. They, they, they look drawn these ones, so I wouldn't I wouldn't generally go out like that. <laughs> oh <laughs> but um but if we're Maybe doing a traditional sixty style, but yeah, you could do a little bit. I always find that if I do like a liquid eyeliner and then I put mascara on, 
I've always got to have false lashes because my eyelashes, you can't even see them because of the liquid eyeliner. And this will be right up for me. I'm going to be really mean now. I'm so sorry. If you look towards me, I'm just going to press a little tiny bit into you. Sounds bad, but it makes me want to go to sleep. I find it really relaxing. <laughs> Mum likes this sort of stuff, like being a model. Oh dear, yeah. I just like being pampered. <laughs> Someone coming in saying, <laughs> What, I look like Arshila? No. Oh, um, someone, <laughs> someone just come in and said, Mel, look like Arshila. <laughs> 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 Just thank oh, God it ain't me. So funny. <laughs> oh dear. I had a sort of funny today on oh, can you bring something 60s? And I was like, I really don't have anything 60s. <laughs> I'm lucky if I fit either. into any of my tops at the moment because I'm still breastfeeding, so nothing fits oh. me. <laughs> I'm baby, so <laughs> <laughs> I still look like I'm I just had a baby. <laughs> Or having a baby. <laughs> you don't. <laughs> <laughs> He's at that age they wear and running around all of the time. Oh, so smiley. Mm -hmm. Oh, you see, no, oh, he yeah, came, he last, came in last time. Last yeah. time just before half term, I think he came in. I oh, know, he's such a happy little boy. He probably isn't right now because he's stuck in a crowd with granny. Just wait until you've got to go through the teenagers again. Yeah. I can't believe I've got to like go through the school bit. I like I love having him as a baby and that, but then like it dawned on me the other day that we've got to go through school and everything all oh. again. And I was like, oh no, I hate the school one. Yeah, it sucks. I bet you'll be making music. When? Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, I never thought of that. So yeah, just keep working on that. So then um, I would just get a little bowl of water. And I would just damp down this brush and then just make that just a little bit stronger on this side. So definitely, definitely go in here with a damp bit of water with eyeshadow. Don't use a liquid liner. And just strengthen that all out. Try and use that technique. I have faith in you, honey. This is the final result of it. I'm really happy with how the hair turned out. But mm, I did struggle with the makeup. But I do usually... I do struggle with the makeup a bit. But stay still. What do you think? I think it looks good. You look like um... Amy Winehouse. Yeah. Oh dear. I wouldn't say that's a good result. <laughs> what do you think, Bumps? What do you, what do you think? Are you clapping your hands? What do you think of mommy? Are you clapping your hands? I like it. I didn't know. Is that funny? I like it better than the other one the other week. I yeah, I do. I keep it. I yeah, know. I am. I was, was going to have it washed out, but I okay, thought I'll leave it. <laughs> yeah. 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 Did you laugh at me? Yeah. Are you trying to say? Is it funny, fam? <laughs> I think it looked that bad. It didn't look bad. You just look different. <laughs> well, you know. Bum, should we go get some lunch? <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Lunch. 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 See, this had a whole crisp bread, most in a packet of finger things, and a banana. When you've had a hard day at college and you're on your way to go and get some lunch, it's definitely worth stopping at Costa for, what you got, Holly? I've got a mango bubble frappuccino, I think is what it's called. Uh, I'm obsessed. They're really nice. I've only ever had one, but it, it's amazing. Yeah, it is nice. Um, I used to really like them as well, but the bubbles started getting on my nerves. So now I've gone on to these. What is it? This is a strawberries and cream, but it's made with vegan whipped cream and oat milk. It is so good. I haven't tried it. Try a bit. I wish you could try a bit of mine. 
I can't, can I? Because of what it's made with. That is nice, but I prefer this. What you got, Mum? Mine's a medium um, as well. Americano, coffee. Mum's playing it safe. Gone basic. <laughs> what do I think of my figure? <laughs> so we've come here for lunch, Brewers Fair. It's a pretty standard place, wouldn't you say? And um, we didn't really know where to go. Actually, we were like, mm, should we go to a Weatherspoon? Should we go to a Troll Cart? Quite limited, really. But you know, they do some pretty good deals in Brewers Fair, especially if you have a loyalty card. So it's definitely worth picking one up if you don't have one already. Dropping your food on the floor, Bambies. No. Oh, you get us into trouble. Who gets into trouble? Ah. <laughs> <laughs> we get into trouble throwing them on the floor. Well, um, he does it in most places, to be honest. But we just have to pick up after him. Mm. Getting curly bumps. Look at these little curls coming through on the top, like Mohican curls. They are so cute. It's going to be like mummy. Mummy had a curly mop of grounded. hair. Are you lining them up, Fumps? No, no! Don't chuck them on the floor. He plays this game at the moment where he picks things up and chucks them on the floor. Great. Do you know how expensive they are? Four of them little small bags. You get a multi pack. I can't remember. Either way, they're not cheap. I know that. And I remember thinking, God, oh, if only he could have like Tesco value Cheetos. <laughs> I don't know. Well done, fam. Drink your water. So when we went to order our food in here, the queue is like a mile long. It's so popular. And they actually only have like one person on the till. I think they have a couple of people waitressing, from what I can see. And um, easy bumps. Yeah, one person on the till, a chef, two waitresses. They probably all help each other, I don't know. But at the time, that's sort of what it looked like was happening. And don't get me wrong, they're really lovely. Nice, they're really polite. But the queue was absolutely massive. And I just thought, how popular is this place? I think it's really good value for money, isn't it? And it's great for lunchtime. You don't have to pay too much. Do you like Rose Fair? I look like a goat. I need a tap. So do I. I look like a goat from the 60s. I look whiter than you. I'm very tired. <laughs> Me too. Anyway, about five hours sleep last night. What are you saying, Bumpies? Stop now. What were you saying? Were you asking for Dada? Where's Dada gone? What is she doing? She's trying to get in someone else's car. Oh my god. So pulled up car. in a car parking spot. <laughs> I saw that, You're trying to get into someone else's car. Mom. <laughs> yeah, we we're in the Audi, not a golf. You've done that a few times, haven't you? <laughs> did you not do something like that the other day? Oh, I was doing the same Wait, well, You did it the other day. That was it, Sienna. You went, you went and started speaking to this kid thinking it was Sienna, oh, didn't you? Okay. And, and, and Sienna went, uh, Granny, I'm here. You and you, there. No, but you told me the story. Oh, oh you're losing it, you are. Yeah, she was playing a, a machine in the arcade and I knew she was somewhere in the arcade. <laughs> and I was going behind this child saying, Oh, how do you play that? I think you've got some winnings. We'd like to get your winnings back. What do you press to get your winnings? And... And this child just was ignoring me. And then Francesca went pa past and said, Mother, wrong kid. 
<laughs> Wrong child. <laughs> you get locked up. <laughs> so we've just popped outside a laundrette um, because Holly wants to go and get her prom dress dry cleaned. And we were just wanting to check out prices and oh, times. Prom dress, by the way. This isn't for this So year. mum pops in to go and find out although don't even know if you've even got a result uh -huh, and as she yeah, turns around to get back in the car she goes to get in the wrong car but it's a nice car it's a Volkswagen <laughs> well that's all right then <laughs> it's same color the color's right and that's all right too as long as it's the right color and it looks good <laughs> dada say dada say dada What? Is it called Pigot? It's what called Pigot? The car. What car? That car. Peugeot. No. It's spelled as in Pigot. Yeah, but With it's T. It's French. Oh. Well, it's French, <laughs> is it then? <laughs> Brilliant. So we've got two people. We've got an old lady and a young girl that's got no... <coughs> to be fair, how was I supposed to know that? I have heard of Peugeot, but... Do you know that... I know I've heard of Peugeot before, but I just didn't realise which one was Peugeot. And then I remember, like, Peugeot being spelt as Peugeot. <laughs> just ignore me. That is the second... Um traffic warden that I've seen in like the space it's of, a of like a minute to be fair, she's why are they congregating here there's the whole of Yarmouth that they can spread out over but there is two here in the space of half a minute so they're on each other's turf let's see if she gets in the wrong car again let's see obviously we're at another dry cleaners this time the other one was closed you found the right car. Well Congratulations. <laughs> Did I get the right car? You got the right <laughs> car. Do you mean mama? <laughs> no, mama. <laughs> oh, what about mama? Mama, mama, mama. Mama, mama, mama. 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 So there you have it, an interesting day all round. It was really nice to be together, to be honest with you. And I must say, I did pick up a few tips along the way. So sometimes it does pay off to be roped into some of these things. Anyway, hopefully you've enjoyed this vlog. If you have enjoyed it, then please give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. And if you haven't done so already, hit that notification bell. And I'll catch you soon. Take care.